Hello everyone. So right now we have already have seen on how to uh, how to change from page A to page B using React Router, and that's what we have seen in the previous video. Right now I'm just going to show you how are we able to route between pages from page A to page B just by clicking on buttons and basically 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 you just need to have like a like click let's say you click on the first button and then you should go to the first page second button should go to the second page here so that's a that's that's the basic idea of what you're gonna do right now so let me just uh, before getting started with those button i'm just gonna uh, select all of this and since we are in apps here i'm just gonna wrap it everything uh, inside this fragment here and then let's and then we're gonna add another uh, another new uh, place here another new uh, example I have nav bar here Sorry. yeah this is correct we're gonna have some nav navigation menu here so this navigation menu is where we're gonna we're gonna have all the buttons that that, that should be like hyperlinks that should go to a particular page and then this way we are able to just uh, swap between pages just by clicking clicking on buttons rather than just saying yeah changing the URL so this will be a better better way to learn on how are we able to make use of uh, react Dr. Tom in more uh, practical way so how are we able to do that just okay this is nav bar here in this case we're gonna have nav uh, in this case I'm gonna create a list and that list I'm gonna have uh, UL and UI so that's the basic format of a, I mean list in, in HTML like this so you can have multiple li inside the same uh, ul so that's the basic idea so in the first li what i'm going to do here is that the, basically the first list that i'm, I'm going to have it a uh, uh, link which with link uh, link uh, let's say it's capital link component and link is basically it's going to be the hypertext itself where we can actually uh, example in this case i'll have to go the first page that we can actually route is actually home so in this case i would like to have my home to be a button and whenever I click on home, it should go to home page. So how are we able to do that? Like by clicking on this particular link here, is that we need to, let's say, let's say this is the uh, link component here. Inside the link component, I can actually specify two. Click and then inside the two, I can actually specify the path exactly like this. For example, in this case, we have already have uh, two, but then in this case, we're gonna put like this. And there you go. So what you can do here, it's just a basic step like this. So let's go and click on save and let's go back to our browser like this. So let's go to a browser. So currently this is in home page here. And if I click on this, it should not go anywhere because this is currently in your home page. So let's have like another list here. Let's see if it works when we have, when you have a router that goes to your second page, which is your book page. So this book page should be having its own uh, path as well, like, like this, basically like this. So the next thing is that let's go and click on save here and let's see if it works from let's say the second time here in this case you have a book uh, menu button here let's say if you click on book and there you go your url has just changed into this you into into whatever we did hit here which is basically basically a slash followed by book and as well as we have also at the same time we have also routed to another page called the book page so that's the basic idea of how we can actually make use of these buttons and and we can actually use link this component called link solemnly just to go to a particular page from page a to page b just by using this by having this link and then followed by two and then you need to specify your urls or uh, endpoint so that's it for this particular video let's meet in the next episode